Hey everybody, Jeff Uvino here with the second edition of the Athletically Honest Vlog. Today we're going to talk about the MLB postseason and some of the things that I think are going to be key for teams to win. I wrote in my blog today that I think that starting pitching is undervalued in today's game, and I think we're going to see that in the playoffs. Um, a lot of teams in the um, current state of the MLB build their teams around good bullpen arms, and whereas before the traditional thinking is we want to build around starting pitching. But I think that once you get to the playoffs, every team sees that you need an ace to win in the playoffs, and good quality starting pitching helps you win in the playoffs. Look at teams that have won recently. Last year, the Red Sox won. Chris Sale was their ace. He carried the team through much of the season and in the postseason. The year before, the Astros had Justin Verlander and Dallas Keuchel as a one-two punch against teams that led them to the championship. Before that, John Lester on the Cubs in 2016. Um, in 2015, when the Royals won, they traded for Johnny Cueto at the deadline. And if we really want to go back a little farther, Madison Bumgarner, the lefty, was a huge part of the San Francisco Giants' three titles in six years. So we can see it, it's not a trend that, that starting pitching isn't still work. It doesn't still work in the playoffs. Um, it's always been that way, and I think it always will be, and I think we're going to see that. Um, especially in the American League, the Astros are built around three horses, horses starting pitchers, whereas the teams like the Yankees are built out of their bullpen. The Astros have Justin Verlander, Garrett Cole, and Zach Greinke, who they traded for at the trade deadline this year. Whereas the Yankees, their number one starter, they're starting James Paxton on games Friday on game one Friday, excuse me, against the Twins. Paxton's a quality arm, but he's none of the three guys that the Astros have. So that's why I think the starting pitching is going to be huge in this year's playoffs. I think they'll carry the Astros to the World Series. In the National League, the Dodgers are absolutely loaded. Hyunjin Ryo is probably the National League Cy Young Award winner this year. He had a couple of rough starts at the end of the year that inflated his RA up into the twos. So that's how you know how good of a year he had. Walker Buehler is an absolute stud, 25-year-old pitcher who shined in the playoffs last year and got them pretty close to a World Series. Oh, and they have Clayton Kershaw, too, so if you know who that guy is by any chance, uh, so it might be the best pitcher ever. But So I think that'll carry the Dodgers to the World Series, too. really want people to focus in on this World Series. You know that bullpens win games. Starting pitching wins championships. Houston over the Dodgers, six games in the World Series. It's a rematch of the 2017 World Series when the Astros beat them in seven. Will the Dodgers lose three World Series in a row? <laughs> if you're old enough, you watch the Bills lose four Super Bowls in a row. So yes, it can happen. Houston over Los Angeles, you heard it here first. This is the Athletically Honest vlog. You can check out my blog today called MLB Postseason Preview, Starting Pitching, Still the King. We'll see you in two weeks. weeks.